my mother said to me when asked uh, if there's anything at her point in life, this is when she was in her 70s, she's 91 now, she was asked by me as part of a study on older people, I was doing interviews, um, and I'm trying this interview out of my mother, and the last question on the list was basically, you reach this point in life, this is roughly what the question was, you know, in which you may spend a lot of time looking back. Is there anything, as you look back, that you've learned that you want to pass on to the people who are following you? My mother said, no. <laughs> <laughs> I said, what do you mean, no? There must be something. She said, no, no. She said, I don't believe in advice. She said, it's been my experience, generally, that it's not listened to. And if it is, you have a very good chance of getting blamed. <laughs> That's here. Um, at any rate, in, in, she's right. I'm not taking her advice. I've written a song with advice in it. Um, it's written for me. Um, so. F sharp. Banjos don't play an F sharp. No, it's okay. But you know, Dan's, Dan's instrument doesn't really sound like a banjo. No, more like a harp, so we decided yesterday that it should have its own name. The Harpo. <laughs> <laughs> She held the door as I walked by I turned one last time She didn't wave or smile She met my gaze with this reply Give more than you take me You're a decent man wrapped in yourself Leave some room for someone else After fame, as those strangers could bring me peace, my star may someday rise, but I realize it'll cast a little light on what I see. Give more than you're taking. It seems to me when all said and done, that's where great joy and peace come from. Thank you. 